In this video, we're gonna put the half inch torque Milwaukee battery powered impact wrench to the test. So this is usually people check the internet, right here, but it's really right here. So just unscrew that, pull it out, this is where you check the air. And it has to be hand tight. This is it. The walk the drill. Guess what, am I gonna be able to take it off or not? As you can see here, the bolts come off like butter. No problem. Tire, not so much, but gotta get the job done anyway. One, two, three, four. The two is enough to put it on. So here we go, the moment of truth. Tightening the bolts back up with the same battery, no extra charge. So I was able to take, replace four tires in total. Uh, I would say about two hours of uh, work and the battery never died and it's still got enough juice to keep going. So it's a pretty badass tool. I suggest you get one. Here you wanna set it at 500. That's right, the perfect spot. And don't forget guys, Make sure you retorque those lug nuts after 50 miles. Safety first. All right, this is the tire max tire inflation system. This light is not your uh, EBS or anything like that. If it's on, that means the system is pumping air in the tires. If it's off, it's all good. Here's what you want to pay attention to. If randomly you're gonna see that light go on, especially after you had your truck parked for a little bit and shut off, uh, there is a chance that you have a nail in the tire or a small leak somewhere because uh, the nail in the tire of that system will keep the tire running until it's just gonna blow out because it's gonna run hot due to the nail issue. So if you start seeing that, check your tires for nails or other problems. And that's pretty much it. In normal condition, it should be off. And obviously, there is a instruction if you can read. <laughs> 